uh yes uh, what's happening guys so today we are at wiener snitchels we're looking at the uh old school chili cheese dog here all right not much to it a little glizzy a little chili a little cheese yes also got the uh chili cheese fries now these these are something else i can't lie they are delicious that's the only thing i order anytime i go to wiener Essentials. all right get the large chili cheese fries oh what's happening fam james and congregator here yes coming at you with another mukbang baby so today we are over at wiener Essentials. yes wiener Essentials. so um i've seen some tiktok posts on like asking who's keeping this place open by spending their money there that's me all right, so, ooh, this is one of their new watermelon lemonades. All right, so, every time I come down to uh, Wiener Schitzel's, I basically just order, chili, so a chili cheese dog, two chili cheese fries, but they've recently have added the bigger chili cheese fries, so um, I'm gonna go with the large fry today. And uh, this is what it looks like. All right, so definitely chunky, definitely on the heavier side. So it's got some weight to it. All right, so uh, let's pull out the receipts and see how much this meal was. Uh, large chili cheese fries were eight dollars and nine cents. Uh, chili cheese dog was three sixty nine. That's kind of steep for a chili cheese dog, but that's okay. And the water watermelon lemonade was three eighty nine for a total of seventeen twenty eight. All right. So, 1728. Mm, I don't mind paying that for uh, Wiener Schitzel's because I know their chili cheese fries are fire alone. All right, so uh, this is what their chili cheese dog looks like. Not much to it. I mean, there's literally a hot dog, soft bun, a layer of cheese, and then they put the chili on top of it. All right, so uh, we're just gonna go ahead and uh, bite this thing really quick. I know you guys are <laughs> fucking glizzy, bro. Anyways, uh, let's go in here. So, their chili is pretty neutral. It's not spicy. Um, and it's just kind of, uh, it's hard to explain, man. Uh, the hot dog looks like a basic old school. That's two bites, almost gone. Like I said, nothing special with it. But uh, if you like chili cheese dogs, it's a decent one. Now, I don't come here for the hot dog. I come here for the chili fries, all right? So I always like to start off with the glizzy, all right? And just like that, hot dog is gone. The cheese dog is gone. Ah, uh, watermelon lemonade is fire. They have a whole line of these cucumber. I think it's their version of the agua frescas. And if you're not sure what the agua frescas are, it's pretty much um fresh fruit juice so like uh, cucumber juice uh, so it's cucumber lemonade uh, they have a strawberry lemonade the watermelon they have a blueberry I can't remember which other one I noticed there all right so 17 bucks you guys think that's a little hefty this wasn't a combo by the way either their combo is kind of kind of suck I don't think they had a large chili cheese fry combo and like i said this this only thing i come here for the chili cheese fries baby all right so their their fries are definitely uh on the thin side there's nothing thick about those fries mm, bro i've been eating wiener essentials since i was a teenager ever since i had a bike so about I don't know, 
12 years old. I've been eating these chili cheese fries since. So. Mm. Now all the cheese finally melted. You know, their fries are kind of like McDonald's fries. They're ta they taste pretty good, too. The chili, again, uh, not spicy, but uh, flavorful. There is a little bit of uh, meat in there, but not a lot. And I will say, this large chili cheese fry is probably going to fill me up. All right. Mmm. Bro. It's too good. Like I said, usually two chili cheese fries, but they've made this large bowl. I think the last time I was here, I was here with my cousin Richie. And it was late. We had just finished fishing. So uh, I felt like having some chili cheese fries. So I ordered regular chili cheese fries, the small ones. And they also have this uh, mac and cheese that Wiener Central started selling. It wasn't that good. I ordered chili cheese fries with um, the mac and cheese on top. Or I think it was just mac and cheese on the bottom. This chili on top. It wasn't good. I mean, I ate it because I was starving. But uh, I don't recommend the um, macaroni and cheese from here. But chili cheese fries all day. It looks like there's a homeless man out there. You know, some people wanted to buy him a meal, but he didn't want it. He said, next time, next time, next time. All right, let's get back into it. Now, chili cheese fries are always full filling. Mm. Definitely a good serving. Serving size. The winner today, though, is this watermelon lemonade. Ooh. They have... Uh, Different style hot dogs here too. So if you want like a Chicago version style hot dog where just a hot dog with like pickles, onions, tomatoes, they got that. I would say every once in a while, not a bad, bad spot to uh, eat at. Would I eat here every day? No. I'll probably come, I can come back tomorrow and eat, but I'm not gonna do that. Um. Just like with everything else, prices have gone up at Wiener Central's. 17 bucks, said that earlier. So cheese fries, chili dog and a drink. Mm. I don't know if you guys would want to spend that, but I wouldn't because I know that I like it. I'm close to the end. And I'm definitely feeling full. There's attack in this, baby. Mm. This thing's getting marked. Mm. Ooh -wee. All right, guys. I wasn't sure if I was gonna get filled up off of that one uh, fry order, but definitely did. So the chili cheese dog, not that special. It seems like there's a like an Oscar Mayer hot dog in it. A uh, little slice of cheese inside that's already melted because of the chili that they put on top is hot, not spicy hot, but temperature hot. 
Oof. But you got to keep it basic when coming here. They're they're known for the chili cheese. So order the chili cheese dog if you come here. I'll give that chili cheese dog a six. Why a six? Eh. It, it wasn't best, but it wasn't bad. Was it uh, worth $3.65? Probably not. They probably could have made that for $1.50, maybe two bucks, you know? But hey, it is what it is. Now, the chili cheese fries, the chili cheese fries were fire. I would definitely uh, recommend ordering the chili cheese fries. Uh, I would get the large. Don't get the, the, the regular one unless you're going to get like a burger, a chili cheeseburger, which they have here which uh, I don't think I'm a fan of. Like I said, I come here for the chili cheese fries, and now I'm definitely coming here for the agua frescas, this um, this watermelon lemonade. So we're gonna go ahead and rate the chili cheese fries a, um, let's do eight out of 10. Uh, they're pretty good, man. So uh, if you guys ever find yourself around a Wiener Essentials, make sure to stop by, get yourself a chili cheese dog, chili cheese fries and you're gonna be all right you're gonna like it it's not bad but uh, if you don't like chili cheese we need the place to go so um uh, thank you guys for joining the uh, mukbang hopefully you guys enjoyed it uh let me know which place to stop by man i need ideas you know so uh we'll catch you guys on the next one let's get it yes sir.